High-tech development is one part of China's path towards modernization, but another long-term mission is getting more people out of poverty. So far, the number of people helped is impressive, but authorities plan to do much, much more. China has already lifted 100 million people out of poverty by February of 2021, and in 2023, the number one central document emphasized the modernization of rural work. President Xi also emphasized that agriculture is the foundation of a modern socialist country. For more on China's poverty reduction plans, we spoke to Robert Kuhn, the chairman and president of the Kuhn Foundation. He's an international corporate strategist and an expert on China. The key point to understand rural revitalization is when the anti-poverty campaign was claimed to be a success because it hit its certain goals. The recognition was that, yes, it brought everyone out of extreme or abject poverty, but relative poverty was still a major problem in China. And this is not something that could be solved in an instant. It's a multi-decade approach. Um, and so almost instantaneously, at the beginning of 2021, after the goal was reached of anti-poverty in 2020, the, the, the whole anti-poverty apparatus, which was enormous in terms of the party, five levels of government, various programs, was transformed to rural revitalization. And so this was not some, the rural revitalization was not something that just came out of the blue, but it was a direct um, um, successor to the anti-poverty campaign. Uh, this one being having a, a bigger uh, a vision because it's, it's bringing you know, hundreds of thousands of villages, particularly in rural areas, up to standards of living that President Xi wants to be roughly in the same level as urban areas by mid-century.